Good morning everybody, welcome back. Today is gonna be a quick one, short one. Gonna be showing some love to my truck finally. It's been a while. Just some simple stuff. Oil change, always gotta get that done. And Logan's gonna let me take the spacers for the front. Maybe we'll be doing a sneak peek of what we're gonna be doing to his truck for this week's what? upcoming you show. You ready for the show or what? I don't know actually. What do you mean you don't know? You're the poster boy Logan. I mean... Or the cover girl. <laughs> I don't have much to do to make sure my truck stays clean during the week. Oh, that's going to be tough. And which means I might get stuck at speed bumps at work. We really got to get ceramic coating done. We do. It's expensive though. If any of you guys want to be our friend and give us a hookup. If we're lucky for free, that would be the best. Oh, wow. I mean, <laughs> we can always trade tickles. Oh! Can you imagine that was my height before? That's way too high. Of course, it's starting to rain now. Jacked up. Wheels off. Now we're gonna place the stands, drain the oil, and while we're doing that, I'll put on the spacers. What size are the spacers that we're putting on? Three quarter. Three quarter. Oil is draining. Now we just gotta get this yellow ring off. That's a biatch. Then, we put on the spacers. Blank, flop. We got him tightened so tight, it broke his back. He did, I can't even stand up straight no more. We need life alert. <laughs> Ooh, look at all that goodness. Quick little tip for all you guys that have this. So if you have this oil catcher, this silver oil catcher thingy, make sure that this black plug underneath, there's a hole for all the oil that gets caught to drain out. Make sure the black plug underneath is in there. If not, it's gonna get all over your engine. Yeah, by the way, he lifted his truck up with a forklift. When you have a forklift, no need jack. Why you never just call Michael? You put him on his back. So you're gonna get some straggling oil that seeps out when you pull the filter out. So you just grab a little rag or something, towel. Soak it all up. So after I tighten the filter, time to throw on the tire and then we'll see how the fitment looks. All right, we got them on. Now let's drop it. Oh my God. It's gonna be poking, dude. Oh, it's stock height again. Nah, nah. <laughs> How's it look? Oh, it looks nice though. We gotta push it down. Watch out, Logan. You're blocking the sun. Sowie, sowie. Oh, snap. Looks a lot better. Let's take that out and you know. Front pokes out a lot more. We're gonna show you how to push it down a little more. <laughs> so, if I hit a pothole, I'm gonna hit all of this. Oh man. It's up to you. I mean, Fuck it, let's run it, bro. It looks nice. Thank you, brother. It looks nice. Yeah, this was his old spacers. He has new spacers. If you didn't catch that one, check out the other video. Now we're gonna clean up, get a little sneak peek of what we're gonna do sneak to peek. his baby. Sneak peek. Oh, can you see it? Can you see it? Can you see it? What's the difference? We're also gonna go pick up some brake calipers. Custom made from our buddy Brant. If you don't remember him, he was from the first drop video. Helped us get the spacers on his truck. So Logan custom ordered these ones cover. We're gonna go check it out after we clean up. Ooh, looks good. Now it's not sucked in all the way like it was last time. Cause the rear pokes out, always does. But now the front matches. Nice. So, that's the caliper cover. Again, we got this from our brother Brand. Thank you. Thank you. Forgot to pay him. Uh, I was so focused on the beautiful work, I forgot about the money. <laughs> so all that's left is a sticker of the X-Runner. Put it on top of that. With X-Runner on one side. Please. And basic on the other. Oh. Hammer. And if you can see how green that thing is, it's pretty dark in here. But if you can, he's also gonna vinyl wrap his whole truck. 
change out the green color. Stay tuned for that. Nice. So when did he get here? Like, Hello there. What are we doing here at Walmart? We're here to pick up something for the team. Illegal. What? It's uh, it's not legal or illegal to have, but it will definitely help us. Our purposes might be illegal. <laughs> oh. You see that with my W? So it's mainly for uh, when we're on the freeway or yeah, you, you know. know like, we, we've experienced just the pass on at um, the cruise night for Puna. Yeah. So like we'd have you know five cars deep, and we'd have to pre-plan everything. But instead, this will actually help us. And if you don't know what we're talking about yet, just try guess in the comments below or something. You know. <laughs> but uh, it would help us communicate better instead of having to text each other or call each other. Yeah. Group chats yeah, and shit. Yeah. Look at this butte we just saw in the garage. Turboed, not sponsored by mom and dad. <laughs> I wonder where we're going. This might be the best, secret agent. worst decision. You're gonna hear. Bolts. Show them, show them. Yeah, seventy dollars, bro. What the hell? Jeez. So we got a bundle of walkie-talkies for all our members for when we do go on cruises, and we'll be able to stay in touch. Thanks for watching, guys. Penis, penis, penis. That was another quick vlog. I think Logan's gay. Yeah. Very yep. true. <laughs> <laughs> He's always going zero to hundred with the gay shit. Back to what we did in high school. And what? And what? Make sure you guys stay tuned for the next vlog when we start wrenching on his car, preparing for the show that's coming up next weekend. And by the time we see this guy again, his truck will look completely different with a different green on it. Let's see. And. We might have new members joining. Oh yeah. I'm thinking about starting an open recruit. So, for all you guys who want to join, hit up the team page DM. That, or me. You know, my Instagram. Or me. Yep, or him. Not me. Down here somewhere. <laughs> Not me, I hardly ever post. <laughs> yeah, don't go to that guy. He's... And it's probably going to end up being gay. Yeah. He be like fat penis on it. <laughs> probably be like, yeah, you got to suck my dick. <laughs> no, it's you got to tickle the pickle.